welcome back programmer the today's section i am going to show you how you can play any game in your low end pc or your low end android even you can play pc game in your android phone i know a lots of you guys search a lots of video about how to play pc game in android now with the use of this method obviously 100% you can use you can play any pc game in your android application so now how does this actually work so first of all i am using the geforce now it called the cloud gaming i know a lots of guy tried this cloud gaming and i know a lots of guy have a complaint that you can't actually play a bigger game but the truth is you can so how does this actually work now what is cloud gaming is that we can't use or pc to play any game because obviously or pc is too low to run any big game like far cry red dead redemption 2 apex legend so what is literally happening in here is that we are not using our own pc we are just casting from another pc like geforce now has lots of pc available and we can directly use that pc virtual pc and play the game in that particular cpu and we can cast that screen using the geforce now application now this application is available in android and pc link is in the description now what you got to do is that first of all you have to create an account in geforce now then download this application in here i am showing you how you can play any cloud game using geforce now pc application i am using the windows 10 now after installing this application you have to connect your all of the account with it like steam epic game geforce ubisoft and so on so as you can see in here i am connecting ubisoft and epic games now this geforce now website or you can say server is not available in india so obviously you have to use the vpn to connect the game now please use the fastest and highest frequency vpn i am using the freedom vpn and i am using the location of northwest of united state of america then just open any game you want for example let me open i tried this apex legend and it worked perfectly fine smoothly but you must got you must have the fastest wi-fi connection like 40 mbps would be fine i'm using the 40 mbps wi-fi now if you have a membership of this geforce now so you can play a game like for six hour but if you are using a free account so obviously you can use only for one hour a session it means after one hour you have to connect a new session it depends on which game are you playing so now even there are a lots of free games available like fortnite apex legend all of this game you can play it in mobile too so let me show you one game which is nothing but the counter strike global offensive so let me play this game now click on the icon then just click on the play button so let me just play it now it will ask that geforce now let you play your games on cloud server to play this game you must sign into your steam account so obviously i have my steam account so i can do it so now it will open it will connect a server between our computer and that geforce computer using or wi-fi as you can see you must have at least 2 gigahertz of wi-fi available so you can play any game now if you are using the multiplayer online game so it will sometime lag but if you are using the story play game like red dead redemption 2 gta 5 there are lots of game like so it will not lag it will work perfectly fine but as you can see i'm playing the online multiplayer game so let's see how it's performing so as you can see i am in full screen now and it is connected successfully with that particular pc so it is opening okay so let me just click on let's go and this is the first time i am playing the counter strike global offensive in this cloud server okay we got the logo so i was it was not working in my because of my screen recorder it was too much lagging and that's why i am showing you guys that this is perfectly working using my without my screen recorder it's perfectly working so as you can see it's perfectly working now i can't use a perfectly mouse because i'm holding my mobile but i just wanted to show you that it's perfectly working if i don't record my screen because I was using the inbuilt screen recorder and that's why it was not working so as you can see it's perfectly working I can even shoot 
anybody I want so it means the game is perfectly working but you can't uh, record the screen when you are playing the game so that's the problem in here so but if you don't want to record the screen it means it's perfectly working as you can see I'm not having any issue with this game so let me show you guys some place so wait a minute I know I suck at game but I just wanted to show you that you can play this game without having any problem as you can see I am not having any issues with this game let me shoot this guy I know this is already dead he's already dead okay somebody killed me so let's try okay I am again here so let first change the gun so okay I'm gonna go with this guy obviously I'm not using my both hand that's why I can show you this game perfectly but I'm trying my best in here so as you can see they started fire or something okay I'm gonna, oh, oh somebody killed me okay he had a Oh, that's me okay it means the game is perfectly working I'm not having any issues so let's just quit the game and let's play another game let me show you another game so let's play this game and I'm recording this through my mobile obviously because I can't record so as you can see I'm not having any issue as you can see my guy is perfectly working animation is very smooth so now let's just play so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to uh play the trio so obviously so let's just click on the ready so now it will take some time to load a game to match a game so as you can see the animation i liked is very smooth i'm not having any issue and because my internet is smooth and i changed the setting to low so it means i'm not having any problem And the best thing is that we can even use our gamepad and you can directly connect it and let me see if it's working or not so let's try this so let's just click on any button okay till now it's not working i think i have to connect okay it's working now as you can see it's perfectly working now i can directly use this controller so as you can see it's perfectly working so now i'm waiting for game to start and i'm not having any issue the quality is perfect and okay i have to click on y to ready i think i just disconnected with because i connected with my gamepad this is taking too much time of matchmaking i know this is the common issue in this apex legend game so let's try to change the map so what i'm going to do is that i don't know how to change this map using a uh, gamepad so obviously i'm going to use my mouse and let me change this to let's directly use a training so we can directly see it's working or not so as you can see it's perfectly working now i am in the training mode so oh wow damn it this is perfectly working i'm not having any issues as you can see guys the graphic is smooth my gamepad is working i'm not having any issues as you can see so i don't know how to 
run fast i think i have to use x i, I never played this apex legend game lot of guy lots of guys talk about this so as you can see it means let me use the mouse so it means it's perfectly working i know how to play it with keyboard so as you can see guys i'm not having any issues but if i start my recording as you can see so i think i'm having a lots of problem as you can see it stopped working 